All right, something you can't see with the naked eye could be keeping an eye on you in your most private moment. Yeah, illegal hidden cameras we're talking about here. They're getting stealthier every day. Seven investigator Ross Jones is live in the newsroom tonight with really a, an eye-opening report, Ross. Joanne Stephen, good evening. Hidden cameras are getting tougher to spot and easier to hide. But the good news, there are ways to make sure that no one is spying on you. The reward from allowing strangers to rent your home is obvious. The risk may not be so clear at first. Well, right now it's making me very paranoid because I feel like there might be more devices. This woman didn't want to be identified, but wants to tell her story to warn others. And there's plenty of other warnings throughout the country. Police say this smoke detector in a vacation rental was actually disguised as a hidden camera. And it's not just in vacation rentals. Beware in public restrooms. Women who thought they had privacy in a car dealership bathroom will be shocked to find out someone may have been watching. The demand for hidden cameras keeps private investigator Jody Stacy very busy. You got to think, like, you know, if they're finding one device, how many did they miss? So, um, again, it's getting cheaper, smaller, and, and, and more effective. Almost anything can hold a hidden camera these days, from a clock to a stuffed animal, even this travel mug. And finding the camera can be a challenge. The woman we talked to earlier felt like someone she knew knew too much about her private life. I feel like he can hear everything I'm talking about and everything I say. So she hired a private investigator who found the fan camera. But for about 100 bucks, you can use a handheld device like this that can spot what's hidden. This is an RF and lens finder. So basically it does an RF, so it has an infrared. Mm -hmm. And when you go through it, it'll flash and then you'll, it'll reflect off the crystal and the lens so you can detect these little pinhole cameras. It works. Look at this clock and then look through the infrared magnifying glass. That's the camera lens. Everything has to have a crystal or a lens in it. So if, like the smoke detectors and stuff like that. Okay. When you went through it like this, it would reflect and you'd see like a little red light and it would tell you that there's a camera in there. Possibly finding something. If I was cleaning that device, I probably wouldn't even know what it was. Before it's too late. And you can buy those hidden camera detectors online. The cheapest ones go for about 20 bucks, much more sophisticated ones north of 100. Guys, back to you. Yeah, it looks like you got to be pretty careful with that thing, though, because those cameras are so small, you might even miss it with that device. Oh, absolutely. They are, they are very small. You need to know exactly what you're looking for. All right, Ross, yes. thank you so much for that. Good warning for us. Yeah, for sure.